So Harley, nice to be back in action this weekend after uh, the break. Yeah, um, good to get back in training and a few days off and looking forward to a game now against a team that we think we can beat. Would you prefer a, a quicker game after the Fulham game or is it good to, to have some time to think on that? No, I think I wanted a game as quick as possible because um, I don't want to leave it a couple of weeks on a result and performance like that. So yeah, we'd like to game sooner but this is how it is and um, we've got to react properly on Saturday. Have you seen the reaction in training? I think it's easy to ask that question, easy to say, yeah, it's been brilliant. Um, I don't think we needed to see a reaction in training. I think the boys knew from the game that we needed a reaction in the next game. So um, I'm sure we'll step up and, and produce a performance. What kind of game are you expecting on Saturday for Blackburn? Um, I think they're a team that are obviously a little bit struggling at the minute, but they've got some good players. Um, I think the boy Gallagher up top, he's a good player. Um, They've got obviously boy on the wing. They've got a few good players, but they're I think they're a team that not really sure in their style of play, and hopefully that we can um, use that against them and and control the game. People talk about winning winning your home games during the away games. After losing at home, does it put any more pressure on getting the result next on Saturday? Um, uh, regardless of the home or away, I think after a loss, you need to respond with a win. So um, yeah, there's pressure on us, uh, but we put the pressure on ourselves. I think most people probably don't think that. Mid table is a bad position for us, but we do, and uh, we want to be better. So we've got to go into every game believing that we can win. I mean, where where do you feel feel the team should be, or where, where do you feel the team can be? I feel the team should be where we are, um, but I think we could be a lot better. Uh, I think consistency is key, um, and I think I think the boys, to be honest, there's been a few players that have been good and spells, and then dropped off and stuff like that, and I think. We've got to be consistent for as many games as possible and, and that will leave us in good stead and we'll win more games than we'll lose. I mean, is that is that the big word moving forward? Is, is that you know putting together, I think it's August was the last time, back-to-back -back wins, so the importance of you know putting results on results? Yeah, exactly. I think you win three or four in this league, it shoots you right up it. So we can easily do it, um, but we've got to all be consistent for not just one game, not just 90 minutes, not just, I don't know, 135 minutes. We've got to do it for two, three, four games in a row and and see where it takes us. And for yourself, how have you seen your season go? Yeah, I mean, uh, as I say, I go back to consistency and I think the, the whole back five has been pretty consistent um, for most of the season, to be honest. I can remember one or two goals this season where we felt disappointed with the way we've conceded, but as a whole, we've been, we feel good and um, I feel good personally, um, so that always helps. Um, but at the same time, it's a team. So if some are not being consistent in front of us, then us as a back five has got have got to help them, and um, that's something that we can be better on. And have you enjoyed the captaincy? Um, yeah, it's been good. Uh, to be honest, it hasn't really made a difference because I haven't changed how I am on the pitch or how I am off the pitch. Um, I always felt like I should have been captain um, a little while ago, but it wasn't to be. So um, yeah, no, I'm happy. I've got it now and. Uh, I feel like my performance is a, a, that of a captain, so um, yeah, I'm pleased with how it's going. So with John, Johan, Andreas and yourself, that, that centre defence role is one that's hot, hot property? Yeah, of course, but the competition and anything is healthy, again, easy thing to say, but um, with the left back being out at the minute, we've got Andreas or Johan playing there, so um, us four become even more important sort of thing, um, and even though two play and two might miss out, we're, we're four, we're very connected and very um, positive with each other and we always want the best for each other, so um, we do push each other, um, but me and Eves are doing a good job at the minute and um, I'll be honest, it's probably the, the most solid I've felt since I've been here in five, six years um, with someone next to me, uh, so yeah, I think we've got uh, seven or eight clean sheets already this, this season, um, we should have had a few more, but it's a good start. And those those clean sheets, something you as a back five and the whole team take pride in? Yeah, I think so, especially when they lead to results. Um, I don't think we've started a lot of games and gone and got early goals, so we've, we've been important where we've had to stop them scoring and give everyone in front of us a chance and opportunity to win the game for us. Um, and as well as that, the back four have popped up with goals. He's just got a couple, I've got one, Max has got one. Um, so we're doing our job at one end of the pitch and we can be doing more at the other end, but we're chipping in. 
and obviously since the break as well, you, you, you've become a father. Congratulations on that, first Thank of all. You. But is that giving you a different insight in the world of football? Um, I think it came at a perfect time, to be honest, with no game and stuff. So it's going to be a little while to get used to it. But uh, yeah, football's, football's my life, but it's not the be all and end all now. Um, I'll never take it for granted and I'll never change the way I play. But I've got someone relying on me now who I need to sort of perform for to make their life better, if that makes sense. So, um, yeah, there's a lot more importance in my career and my future in my mind now and where I want to be going. Um, yeah, I mean, I've got to do it for him now, so that's, that's sort of my mindset.